absolutely love this intro guys every single Friday to talk about one of our favorite stocks guys and make sure to be subscribed also <laughs> and like this video if you are appreciating those Virgin Galactic Fridays and let me tell you maybe this is the last Virgin Galactic Friday before the next test flight so we will talk about the space performance uh, of the last week the stock went absolutely down but is it a uh, time to worry or to be sad or to celebrate because there's much more to them uh, we will talk about then the stock chart as well uh, what we need to know fundamentally uh, a little bit of techniques to see what is there for a basement when the news hit the fan <laughs> then we know how the stock could react and then finally we will talk about how you can get your hands on very very early when this test flight could be announced there's a lot of sources like reddit you know uh, our discord chat the general news twitter and so on and it has something to do with the faa website where you can get your hands on this kind of information very very early so this is the three things we will talk about today so without further ado let's dive in Guys, if you are following me on Instagram, you know that sometimes at the pool in Dubai, I am reading the book that I ordered here, the first 10 years of Virgin Galactic. It starts very interesting and I will also share all my thoughts about it, maybe in some of the videos here, but for sure in my Virgin Galactic case study that I'm filming right now. I will release that as a part three of my X. 10masterclass.com so check it out get your discount of 10% get lifetime access to the discord where we have many many people from investing in Virgin Galactic talking about Virgin Galactic every single day it's a very vibrant community and if you get not only the 10% discount but also when I release part 3 the case study of Virgin Galactic then obviously the price will rise so you have a fantastic chance to go there and you know spend uh, your Virgin Galactic earnings quite intelligently right to invest in yourself I think this is one of the best things that you can do for uh, becoming a better investor but let's talk about the space performance of the last week I mean it was obviously not that fantastic when we were almost at 60 on the 11th of February and since then lost about 16% but if you're considering the overall situation uh, where the months look like that 61% uh, uh, then I'm not that much you know worried at all because uh, at the valuation of 11.62 billion dollars as of this recording we are in a pretty good mid-range field where I see Virgin Galactic staying for a couple of weeks however the test flight and we will talk about how uh, we see the breaking news about the test flight where we can find them and so on in the last category of this video so stay tuned till the end and we also will dive into the stock chart more deeply if we see any trends and what this can bring us to a stock price when the news will be announced currently we are waiting it's a waiting game right uh, as always it's not very easy to bring spaceships into the low orbit so uh, they are working on some technicals as we know from the last tweet and I'm quite uh, convinced that we should get any minute uh, or any day now an update for the crazy new test flight okay and I think if we should not get the information by Friday today then maybe we will get it on beginning of the next week or in the next week in general because uh, you know the FAA which is the uh, you know Federal Aviation Authority in the US will get in touch with uh, Virgin Galactic or Virgin Galactic will get in touch with them and then they will agree and apply for a NOTAM and all that later on in the vlog so as you can see here I'm obviously a little bit down from the recent high of almost $60 but hey at such a performance at such money we could do already since the beginning of the year which is you know about 113 percent i'm not worried at all so you know guys we love to talk about gsx the next type 
of coin that actually is a stable coin and a growth coin and it's actually melt both profits together okay both is fantastic because on the one side it's backed by assets which are mines and you know there is a quick update and a fantastic one we love to have updates on that because you know specifically when there is something new there's not always you know breaking news but gsx and the CEO Steve is actually going to Zambia and they are talking with governments because they are looking for new mine projects, right? So on his Twitter account that you should follow you can see here you know they flying out there talking with the government having a red carpet event so this thing is really really real okay so check it out there's a lot of updates by him it's fantastic to follow but there is even more to that why you should consider GSX right now so besides paying dividend for you once you own GSX besides that they will destroy all the remaining coins after the pre-sale which ends by the way in March already so it's a really last opportunity to buy at this price guys so check it out on the website it's very very easy the link is into the description with all the information about GSX but also about how you get 5% extra when you use my link below take your credit card out put it in buy some GSX if you're thinking this is a great investment for you and it's aligning with your investment horizon. But you know, they have so many other reasons that we talked about here. If it's the stacking, where you put the GSX to them and they will hold it and give you for that some extra GSX coins, which is for example, 10% just for one year, 20% for two years, or even 30% for three years. And if you are thinking this is something for you, then I don't know what you're waiting for because you can also go to the GSX main office and always exchange your GSX coins against the real gold quantity that it's backed for. So what are you waiting for? So let's have a look into our favorite stock on Fridays. Virgin Galactic Fridays is one of my uh, favorite episodes, guys, uh, to really talk about this space company is such a pleasure. And if you like it as well, just uh, let me know in the comments or hit that like button, guys. This is always highly appreciated. So not much changed, actually. As expected, we are holding strong the uh, $50 mark or just about the $50 mark here. You see the Bollinger Band in the middle here is uh, also arrived already. We went through the overall situation where we were very much uh, on top of the Bollinger Bands, which is always a reason to re retreat a little bit. We saw it here, we saw it here. We saw it here when we are following. I mean, here, uh, the nice thing about it here, we, we, we just jump on the trend. So we didn't went into the sideways position. So the stock uh, stayed strong. But anyway, so as you can see, I'm expecting that we don't go below, you know, somewhere here at 48 uh, or 43 would be the, the point where I say, okay, this levels, uh, even when it's going even more down, because for example, if there's no update for the flight and there will be, you know, a more negative drain by the slowly going downwards market a little bit, you know, we're seeing a small correction here of the overall market, you know, Tesla, Beyond Meat and all the other stocks, uh, are going down a little bit, but that's uh, totally healthy. So we definitely broke through this absolutely insane trend here, which uh, was obviously not very sustainable for a long time. But then, you know, the, the good thing is that we didn't fall below that uh, resistance yet, that, that this would be fantastic. Here's now the support. Then we have another resistance here at 43 around. So I expect that we don't fall that much. And then if all the breaks, uh, all the things break, let me just pull this a little bit straight. We still have a resistance somewhere here at 34. Uh, with the 50 moving average, which also would pull back a little bit if the stock goes down. So a lot of things showing that we should hold those levels and uh, just stay strong, guys. Just hold long term. I think this is the best advice I can give you. The RSI level also falling to uh, 53, which is fantastic. Always a good 
uh, basis here as uh, back in uh, October 2 uh, moved to higher level. So all of that is all really, really uh, a good and healthy pullback, which uh, gives us a nice base, a fundamental base here to reach higher levels uh, with a successful test flight, with announcement of a successful uh, a new date. And uh, yeah, I'm just uh, super, super interested what we will see in the next couple of days. So let's jump into when and how we can see the next test flight. So talking about the next test flight, how you know as Virgin Galactic investor firsthand how the test flight is happening and when. So actually I will show you a nice trick. So first of all, let's talk about NOTAM. NOTAM is a notice to airmen, is a notice filled with an aviation authority to alert aircraft pilots of potential hazard along a flight route or at a location that could affect the safety of the flight. Now, you might think, okay, why he is showing me that? So the NOTAM is actually a notification that is in the system of the Federal Aviation Authority in the US, which usually is filed by the spaceport or Virgin Galactic and said, hey, listen, we want to make our space flight at this date between this and this hour. So make this notification in your system. This is actually where we find it on the website here, as you can see. But how I went to that is actually when Michael Sheets, which is, you know, the CNBC corresponder for space, uh, posted this and was one of the first informations that uh, this is happening. So you can see here, if we are going on this website, you can search here for the NOTAMs and then you can write, obviously the spaceport would be the location of our interest here, New Mexico location. And then you see that there is basically no NOTAMs found, searched just right now. And here is how you get this information, okay? So it's not like uh, that this guy has uh, uh, more information than you, it's all public guys. So study that, make sure to follow that. I think this is the, the best source of knowing firsthand, obviously beside the Twitter of Virgin Galactic when we will do the test flight. And then what the stock will do, I believe that the stock will do, you know, a move of 10, 15%, what we saw as well uh, in the recent test flight. Why? Because, you know, uh, history don't repeat itself, but we know patterns, right? I mean, we know that for example, the situation was that we gained 15% when the test flight was announced or the test flight window, we knew that something is happening. We knew it could be this weekend, but it was confirmed. So the stock raised even further. Then we had this bummer with the technical tests, you know. So the stock lost uh, more than 14% uh, from its high, as we have seen in the first category of this video. So you have here, you know, this back and forth, and I think that we just bounce back a little bit once this is announced. So stay tuned. I will definitely mention this on my Twitter, on my Instagram. So follow me on this channel as well to be informed immediately. Once I know something, I will share it there as well. And be subscribed here on this channel, guys, to never miss very, very important Virgin Galactic news as well as my personal opinion about it as, you know, early space investor. So uh, make sure also to smash that like button.